the weird sky. Sprinkling rain. You think they have tornadoes? I googled it, but it was taking too long. So. Good morning, YouTubers. It's New Year's Eve, and uh, I don't have a date, so I'm gonna stay home. <laughs> I need to get out and socialize, though. I really do, and it would be good filming. So I'm already devising a kitty questionnaire as an icebreaker so I can talk to people on YouTube. I could be out socializing. There's the Yacht Club. Don't really want to spend money, but it's been my experience. I never have to buy more than one drink. But now at age 71, it could be more. I mean, could be, uh, that could be history, right? <laughs> so uh, tonight there's a seniors New Year's Eve party and I really thought about going to that, but uh, I have a feeling it's gonna be a lot of couples tonight. So I'll just stay home. But my resolution is just to become closer to God and increase my prayer life and reason. So I just want to become a better person, um, be kinder, more understanding, less judgmental. And that's a first for me. I've never had a uh, New Year's resolution list like this before. So anyway, why don't you get to leave in the comments and tell me what your resolutions are. I have a great New Year's Eve and New Year's and I hope all your dreams for 2023 come true. Please subscribe. I don't beg much on my site, but um, I've had like several thousand views on some videos. I just wish people would hit subscribe. It doesn't cost you anything. You know, I'd like to get up to a thousand. And from all the thousands of viewers, you don't ever have to look at another video again. Just hit subscribe so I have that on my tally. That's what I'm doing. When I, you know, I get all these pop-ups and if it's interesting, I'll, I'll click on it. And if I'm not a if I haven't subscribed to that person and they're under a thousand, I definitely subscribe just to help them out. Um, if if they have like 2,000 plus and I'm not really interested in what their videos are about, then I don't subscribe because they don't need my help. But I'm just trying to be kind and I just wish other people would hit subscribe for me. It'd be nice, even if you don't think you'll ever watch another video. So I'm on my way to Blythe, California. I have a healthy foods card that expires today. And only certain places will take it. It has to be a Walmart and usually an Albertsons. So I'm going to Blythe to check out their Albertsons. But at any rate, it's another cloudy day, kind of semi-cloudy. Um, I'm not real happy with the weather here, I gotta be honest. Oh, there I go, I said I gotta be honest again. I said I wouldn't say that anymore, okay. I should have a jar where I put a buck in every time I say, to be honest with you. So, um, I'm gonna film a little bit in Blythe and see what it's about. There's only two towns when you're in Quartzsite that you can go to for mass grocery shopping. And that is Parker, where Walmart is. And that is, from my campsite, it's gonna be close to 40 miles. Cause it's 35 once you get to the sign that says 35 and I'm like five miles from that. So, you know, it's a long drive. And um, I'm anxious to see Blythe is probably about 13 miles closer or maybe 20. No, I mean, more, maybe 10. And it's not that big a difference, but since I'm so sick of Walmart, I thought I'd try Albertsons in Blythe and see what else is going on there. I tried to see if they have a dog park because I got pepperoni with me. Hey, Pepper, say hi. Say hi to the YouTubers. He thinks we're, you know, I feel bad because 
he thinks we're going to uh, Portside Dog Park. I know he does. Every time he gets in this car, we pretty much go there before I do errands. And that brings me, errands bring, brings me to another issue. This, I've been there, what, six weeks now? I've spent every day dealing with issues that I hadn't resolved before I came. I hooked up my new solar panel, so we'll see if we can get a bright sunny day if they're an improvement. And I'm going to charge my lithium battery tomorrow and then switch them out as soon as I get a full charge and see if that helps. My gut feeling is my refrigerator isn't going to come back on. And that was my main issue because I have to go for ice every other day. And, you know, that breaks up my day. By the time I do the dog park, run a couple errands, grab my ice, and I've been getting two gallons of gas to put into the RV because when I run my generator, to charge my solar generator, um, you know, I'm, I'm drinking gas. I basically fill up a two gallon gas can every time I come to town to make up for the gas I use when I run my generator to uh, charge my solar generator. So I'm trying to see what the price is. Okay, I'm going for cheap regular, $3.39. And the premium, which would have to go on my Lexus, is three eighty four. Better than the four fourteen I paid last time I filled up. YouTube. <laughs> Pepper was telling me with his body language that he had to go poo. So I'm stopped at a uh, gas station at the edge of Blythe and I'm going to ask him where the Albertsons is. <laughs> because Siri's of no help, let me tell you. I think she sabotages me. I'm convinced of it. Or is that paranoia? Can you tell me where the Albertson is? You go straight down, hit Hopson Way, right here in the middle, and you're gonna go all the way down. It's gonna be on your left hand side, the first uh, light. So I'm staying on this road Stay right out here. Stay on this road right here is Hopson Way. Okay. Yeah. Wow, you look really pretty. Oh, well, thank you. <laughs> I wasn't even looking at you until I started filming. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Uh -huh. I used up my card, and it's a wonderful grocery store, but um, I forget I'm in California. It's more expensive. Okay, I asked the checkout girl at Albertsons where the town was, and she goes, you're in it. I said, so these streets right around here are your town? And she said, yes.